Hi again, here's part two of the overview of the Dodeca Module 212R. And this time we're going to look at using the noise. The noise comes out and goes into low pass gate one. I know this is sort of a cat's cradle, but I'll talk you through it. So signal path is a high noise to low pass gate one. That's going out to the signal in of the voltage controlled bend width filter. And the center frequency of that is being controlled by the stored random voltage. And then that's going out to the mixer. And that's coming down to the first section of the output amplifier. If you recall, that's CV goes to amplitude. And so it's sounding like this. Okay, in the next band, or low pass gate, we've got some ring modulated sounds. What I'm using for that is basically a sine wave uh, out of the um, principal oscillator and a sawtooth wave out of the modulation oscillator. And that's ring mod. And that's going to the second low pass gate. I'm doing that cascading trick. I'm taking pulse out of uh, the envelope one and going to envelope two. And I have a very short envelope there. And that's then bridged over into the audio of the second section of the output amplifier. And that's being bounced back and forth randomly in the spatial space. Oops. This one. Okay, we'll balance, balance those in a moment. And the third element is uh, coming from the mod oscillator. Uh, and it's coming into the third low pass gate. It's once again doing this cascade thing. This time I have a very slow um, ramp CV on that, bridged over to the low pass gate here. And so that sound is like this. And the reason it has that pulse sign is because I'm taking the pulse out of the first envelope and sending it straight to the frequency of the mod oscillator. So here it's all together. Okay, there you go.